Lupino Lane is best remembered as the man who made the Lambeth Walk famous. When he died in 1959, that's what the obituaries mention. What most of them failed to recall was that Lupino Lane had once been a star of the silent screen, a comic who had rivaled Chaplin and Keaton. Like many English comics before him, he'd started his career in vaudeville, but soon left for Hollywood in the footsteps of Stan Laurel and Charlie Chaplin. Within a short period of seven years, he'd made well over 40 films. But by 1929, with the arrival of a talkies, his small studio was forced to close. The negatives of all the film were destroyed by fire, and most of the nitrate prints were sold for their silver content. It was only by accident in the mid-1960s that film historian Philip Jenkinson first came across a Lupino Lane film. After years of research, he's finally managed to track down and restore 14 of the original prints. And tonight's programme presents some of the best moments from that lost legacy of Lupino Lane.
Joyland marked the end of Lupino Lane's silent film career. When the studio closed in 1929, he returned to vaudeville. His real success in the movie business had come to an abrupt and unhappy end. From now on, he was to make only the occasional talking picture. Hey ho, life's a misery. I know, you agree with me. I'm the kind of guy, good luck is always passing by. There is so much I want to do, but when I find my schemes fall through, who can I tell my troubles to but you, oh, now? When things go wrong in what I've planned, nobody seems to understand, nobody gives a friendly hand but you, oh, now? I try so hard to make a name I want to rise to wealth and fame But people won't believe in me They can't see fame for me 